And welcome back to Bitcoin Advisors channel. My name is Chris bringing it to you here from Westlake Village, California. It's bright. It's early. It's Tuesday afternoon, Wednesday afternoon. Who knows what day it is, but we got a bunch of coins on the market here. We got Bitcoin trading in a range, still in the four hour range, did slink below the range here, got scooped back up. I imagine one more tick back to the upside before we get a major trend reversal. So grab liquidity there, come back here, and then that's where we let it rocket off to the moon. Let's draw it again. Let's draw it again. Let's make it perfect. If my lines of peace and prosperity will follow themselves, we'll all make a bunch of money here. Grab liquidity there, there, boom. And here we go. 36K, where are you? 36K, let's, let's go for that 1618 fib. Let's see how close did I get? Close enough is close enough, sir. That's what I'm looking for it is a little bit of up, down, sideways, more to the right and up. That's what I'm looking for as NASDAQ is ripping on to some new daily highs again this year. And you've got S&P and the Dow Jones all doing the same thing. Measure move for the Dow Jones back up there all the way up to with this inverted head and shoulders again, this one playing out rather nicely uh, so far. So good. Bitcoin dominance taking a leg down and the more this goes down, altcoins have a chance to run Ethereum Bitcoin popping up here, getting back closer to the trend line, the trend line of peace and prosperity and death and despair for our altcoins. As I imagine, if we go up here and reject back below this pivot area and then come back down, that'll look very bad for altcoins. Any kind of a closure back below that last pivot right there. No bueno for the altcoins. And let's check out Fetch AI, Fetty Wap coin, not doing much there. Stacks. Uh, Stacks, I do imagine still has a chance for a bounce here. What am I talking about is this bounce off of this channel, which has not broken back into the channel yet. Close enough is close enough. We just want to see this one pick one up and put in a higher low, but you cannot because it is lower lows. So I do not like this setup. I would say setup averted and crisscrossed down. I'm not in this one and take it down. Take it down. VIX is going up. Volatility goes up and the stocks go down. Stocks go down. So that's just something to keep in mind on. Total is at 1.1 trillion on the weekly and that one's looking pretty good as well uh, for some upside continuations kind of ranging here between 1.2 and uh, $1 trillion. Bitcoin dominance, we went over stacks. Uh, what other coins do we want to take a look at? Mr. Cardano up 4% today, getting picked up. Looks like has a little more to go on the weekly, on the daily, uh, looking for one more. One more closure above this pivot and another threatening attack to that purple 200. Coming in at 35 cents. Mana looking weaker than Cardano. Matic, same thing. CFX looking weak. Uh, SSV, weak. VRA, weak. Gold, uh, almost hit the upside target. Probably has a little bit more to go. Silver is already above the target that we last had. Ave is another good one. It just needs to bounce from this critical area right here, put in a higher low and any kind of a closure tomorrow back above 73 cents is gonna look bullish for a run back up to the top side of these wicks coming all the way back from this pivot right there, boom. So somewhere around 92 cents. And Algorand looking slinky linky and Arbitrum uh, trying to dig its way out of a grave, head and shoulders inverted. And I've got another call coming in. Uh, I think I'm gonna wrap it up there. 
As we've hit a few of the currencies are down, uh, dollar's probably up at the moment, Ethereum at 1907. Nvidia at 470, Microsoft 355, Google 122, Amazon 135, and uh, another interesting one, Coin. Mr. Coinbase waking up and cranking up to the upside and can it get back above this pivot? Well, if it does, then the next pivot's gonna be 206, almost double from where we're at today. That's it for today, guys. Hope you have a blessed and highly favored day. I will be back tomorrow. Take care.